You already know what it is, it's your boy Mouse, and welcome to the Mouse Chat. Yeah, welcome back, welcome back, guys. You already know what it is, you feel me? If I'm back when I'm back with another what? Banger, yes, sir. You feel me? So, welcome back, guys. Y'all miss me? I miss y'all, you know what I'm saying? As y'all can see, we in a new house now. You feel me? It's your boy Bathroom, yes, sir. Looking exquisite. Mighty fine, you know what I'm saying? Walking closet, you feel me? It's not, I ain't, you still see clothes on the floor, you feel me? You still, you know how it is when you first move in. You know, all that's going to come later, you know, organizing and all of that, you know what I'm saying? But yeah, though, um, real quick though, before we start this video, for all those that's brand new to, to the channel, I need y'all to stop what y'all doing. Make sure y'all like this video. Don't forget to um, comment down below. Don't forget to subscribe. That notification bell, you know the thing that go ding, 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 ding. Yeah, that right there. Go ahead and click on that. So whenever you drop these amazing bangers, y'all be the first to know, you know what I'm saying? So yeah, though, so um, today's vlog, vlog is going to be simple, you know what I'm saying? I just want y'all to take a ride with me, you know what I'm saying? Um, I got some errands to run. I'm actually on my way right now to go get my um my haircut. You know, boy, I gotta stay fresh. You feel me? Cause a lot of y'all been just witnessing when your boy been down. So ain't no more of that. You know what I'm saying? We leaving that in the past. You feel me? So from here on out, I was just gonna see nothing but your boy being nothing but up. You know what I'm saying? Just got a lot on my mind. You feel me? So um. You know, I'm trying to be nothing but transparent with you guys, you feel me? So, yeah, y'all stay tuned. I'm actually about to leave the house right now as we speak. Say, say what's up, baby? What's up, Mousetrap family? Yes, sir. As y'all can see, we ain't got no bed right now. We literally just moved in. You know, God um, finally answered our prayers and he blessed us. And all I can say is, we back. <laughs> So yeah, though, so I'm about to walk out the crib right now. Got to put on my shoes and all that. Um, Y'all stay tuned. I'll check back in with you guys as soon as I get inside the car, right? Get. Yeah. All right, y'all. <clears throat> Told y'all. I'm headed out right now. I'm on my way to the barber shop. So yeah, though, um, like I was saying, I wanted to be transparent with y'all, you know, from here on out, you know? Like, I want you guys to be able to relate to me, y'all, like, I'm none of them other YouTubers, bro. Like, with this channel, we ain't scripting nothing. You feel me? Everything that y'all seeing um, that I drop is coming from the heart. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm not scripting nothing. You know why? Because at the end of the day, I want you guys to know that we're human beings and I'm not a robot. You know what I'm saying? And at the same time, I want you guys to know, yes, we all go through things. You feel me? Give me one second. <sighs> Give me one second. Take off my bag real quick. Hope. Let me be great. <laughs> yeah, the, um, yeah. I just want everyone to be able to actually relate to to me. You know what I'm saying? Like, cause I know we all go through real life situations. You know, we all go through real life problems. Um, and you know, like right now, I'm getting a lot of backlash. First, hold on, give me one second. Safety first. Let me put on my seatbelt. Oops, sorry about that. Yeah, all right, got it. Yeah, so, um, yeah, I'm getting a lot of backlash because, you know, um, recently when we was homeless, um, I posted all of my videos showing you guys that I was homeless and all of that. And the backlash was coming from mainly from majority of my family, you know? Like they were mad that I was putting our business out on social media. But what they felt to understood was the re understanding why I did it, you know what I'm saying? Like at the end of the day, you guys, I built my platform and I've been building it for a reason, you know what I'm saying? And it's like what I was when I was going through my situation, nobody was wanted to listen to me or believe me, you know what I'm saying? It's like as if like I was living in a lie or telling a lie, you know what I'm saying? And I was telling the truth the whole time, you know? Um, I can't really get into full detail like I told y'all because it's, um, ever since I got arrested, um, it's still an ongoing investigation. Um, my next court date is in October. So I can't really go into to depth as far as, into details as far as exactly what happened into the case. But you guys could pretty much put, you know, two and two together for you know, read between the lines, you know? 
So yeah, it was, um, yeah, so they getting mad at me for posting and this and that. But what's crazy is when I posted, I got the attention though, you know what I'm saying? And then what's crazy is like, I'm getting all support from strangers, from, you know, from friends that's outside of the family. And I'm looking at that like, damn, that's crazy. I, I would, I was expecting that to come from family, you know, to reach out to me to figure out why I'm spazzing out the way I'm spazzing out. But instead, they did the opposite. They were more mad that I was putting the family business out there. Well, um, you guys put yourself in my shoes. You know what I'm saying? Like, if you're being framed and you're being lied on and someone's telling you that you did something that you really never did, and then because of that fact, you had to go to jail, my rights were violated, you know what I'm saying? To the point where I'm on probation now, I can't leave the state. Like, how do you expect me to stay quiet throughout this whole entire situation? Like, no, like, I'm gonna, I'm gonna speak out. It's not true, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm innocent, you know what I'm saying? Like, I am gonna speak out, you know what I'm saying? I'm not gonna stay quiet like they wanted me to do, you know what I'm saying? But it's all good because at the end of the day, by me going through this situation, it made me realize a lot. Like, my real family is my immediate family, which is my wife and kids, you know what I'm saying? Um, no disrespect to them, you know what I'm saying? But yeah, you know, like when you go through tough times, you go through situations, it exposes a lot, you know what I'm saying? And I'm thankful that I, I kind of did go through this because I got to see who's truly on my side and who's truly not, you know what I'm saying? And to all the ones that, that's been supporting us, been praying for us and been on my side this whole entire time, I want to let you guys know that I love you from the bottom of my heart. and. I thank y'all for that because at the end of the day, y'all really truly know me. Like, you get you know what I'm saying? Like, y'all know I'm not that type of person. I, I go above and beyond for my family and threatening to kill them, I would never do such a thing. You know what I'm saying? And trust me, the truth will come to light come October. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, so from here on out, I just want to be transparent with you guys and let you guys know that, you know, I'm the real deal. You know what I'm saying? Like, slowly but surely you guys will see that you know what i'm saying and then when i make it to where I, i'm about to make it to all credit will be well deserved you know what i'm saying like like i want you guys to be able to relate to me y'all like yes i've been down i've been up i've been down i've been up i've been homeless i stepped in my car you know what i'm saying like like i, I just want to let you guys know what really got me going through it was one not giving up two having a strong faith in God and three just having some real real close family supporters which is crazy not from my side but from the other side which is my um, wife's side you know what I'm saying and salute to them shout out to them they know who I'm talking about you know what I'm saying um but yeah besides that I ain't gonna lie life is great y'all look at that life is great can't complain you feel me like I'm back y'all you feel me I'm back so I just want you guys to not only witness my down, but also my up. Because from here on out, I'm trying to tell y'all, it's only up from here. You know what I'm saying? So y'all stay tuned. You already know what it is. Yeah! I'm back. Yes, sir. Well, I ain't gonna lie, boy. It's something about, boy, when you get a fresh cut, boy. Boy, be feeling like a new man. You know what I'm saying? Yes, sir. I'm back. You know what I'm saying? So, um, before we start this video, real quick, for those that's brand new to the channel, I need y'all to stop what y'all doing. Make sure y'all like this video. Don't forget to comment down below. Don't forget to subscribe. That notification bell, you know the thing that go ding, 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 ding. Yeah, that right there. Go ahead and click on that. So whenever you drop these amazing what bangers, y'all be the first ones to know. You know what I'm saying? So y'all man, I'm back, y'all. I told y'all man from here on out, man. It's only up from here. It's only up. Boy, y'all lucky I'm 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 taking boy. I lucky boy. You know what I'm I would have had to show y'all. Let me stop playing, you feel me? I'm happily married to my baby, you feel me? I tell y'all man, I love that girl. I love that girl, man. I love you, baby. I know you're watching this. <laughs> I love you. When I tell you, man, 20 years, y'all, high school sweetheart. Met her in my 10th grade, my, yeah, my 10th grade year and her 9th grade year. She was coming into, um, as a freshman, you feel me? Yeah, I mean, we've been rocking ever since, you feel me? I ain't gonna lie, though. It wasn't perfect. 
we've definitely been through our ups and downs. For those that's, that know us personally, you know, definitely been through our ups and downs, you know what I'm saying? But we just stuck in the old ways, you know? When things are broken, you feel me? You don't just throw it away. You fix it, you know what I'm saying? That's the key to it, y'all. That's the key to a strong relationship, you know what I'm saying? And I could prove it because, look, I was just homeless, man. I know a lot of y'all would have been banged the exit to the left, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm not dealing with this. Hell no. You got me sleeping in a car? Not her. She stood beside me, you know what I'm saying? She still gave me loving. She uplifted me and never left my side, you feel me? So it's only right, man, that, you know, when we do get to the top, you know, I continue cherishing her and, you know, continue giving her the world, you know? She deserves it, you know what I'm saying? Like, I ain't gonna lie, man, that's, she's my real backbone. Like, you know, like, that's my yin and I'm her yang, you know what I'm saying? That's how it's supposed to be, y'all. You feel me? So, for those that's going strong out there, salute. You feel me? Trust me. I know how it is. I ain't gonna lie. I'd rather have one girl than multiple girls. I don't even know how y'all could do that, bro. Because at the end of the day, nowadays, you can't just give a girl bubble gum. I wanted to say the other word, but, you know, I got kids watching. So, but y'all know what I mean for me. It ain't about that no more. Now these girls done got smart. They done woke up on y'all. <laughs> you got to spend that check. Where they said... Nowadays, it's all about the money. I feel sorry for y'all in this dating pool, this new dating world. You know what I'm saying? Hey, salute to y'all. <laughs> but like I said, when you do find that right one, you know what I'm saying? You hold it down. You, you feel me? You cherish her. You treat her like the queen that she is. I ain't, I ain't got time to be trying to start all over. Like, I ain't got time for that, bro. Like, I'm straight. I got my, my family. You know what I'm saying? I'm already rich. You feel me? I'm wealthy through family, you know what I'm saying? Like, so all I'm missing is the, the finance, as far as the finance, which I'm already on my way to that. So, so imagine when I get to that, ooh, y'all in trouble. Yeah, I just wanted to tell y'all, you know, I'm back, feel me? I'm about to go back to the house now, so uh, me and my babies could get ready to go to the pool and enjoy our our Saturday, you know what I'm saying? Like it's supposed to be. You feel me? So um yeah, so y'all stay tuned. Um shout out to everybody that's been staying tuned, been following along. Um we I'm talking about the real mouse trap supporters of the true mouse trap fam. You know what I'm saying? Like y'all know who y'all is, you feel me? Salute to y'all, you feel me? So y'all stay tuned. Get yeah.